It's funny because it's sort of like uh, you have a family member who you disagree with, or maybe you you don't you don't like them so much. Um, you have problems with them, but then if somebody, one of your friends or somebody who's not in your family, starts insulting them, you feel like, well, hold on a second. I can I can be critical, but you don't even know what you're talking about. And that's how that's how it felt for for all those years when, I mean. You know, even with Ahmadinejad going around saying stupid things and just like repulsive things, I think a lot of Iranian Americans, they're like, I don't like this, I don't like this president, I don't like this regime. But when people just start piling on and talking about, you know, just bashing Iran, they sort of felt like, well, this isn't a nuanced perspective that you have. This just feels like an attack on anybody with any connection to Iran. I think that, like, for us, for Iranian Americans, we, we, we're sort of immune to being brainwashed on this issue because we're not going to take anything at face value. We actually are going to pause to think about what people are saying and actually have some nuance about, you know, uh, not looking at this as a black or white issue because this isn't black or white for us. This is, you know, this is our families and our friends and our heritage. So we have to think more nuanced than, than a lot of people do.